Okay, I think we're good and all set up for my 51st video. I just did my 50th video if you want to go check out that for time travel it is possible. And it was back to the future and then right now I'm going to do a four, five part, six part series on Halloween stuff that I've not taken a look at yet. So we're going to start with this guy, but you know, go ahead and subscribe and and uh, hopefully we can get you some good stuff and hopefully you guys are getting excited about Halloween and, and tell me about what you're putting up. This guy, I call him Pumpkin Guy, he's, uh, I don't have a year on him, I'm thinking early 2000s, I could be wrong. Oh, and I am talking softly because I'm in the, the back here of my back deck area. And um, this Pumpkin Guy, I didn't get him too long ago, but uh, he is made by the ESC Trading Company and when I look them up they have a lot of stuff that they've made I don't get too excited about any of the stuff they've made and I haven't been able to find this guy the pumpkin guy on the internet anywhere so let me know if you've seen him or have a date on him or you have him yourself um, you know it's always cool if you have something that's kind of rare and you can't find it on the internet but uh, then you don't find out a lot of information about it this one's about eight inches tall, I would say. Yeah, he's about eight inches tall. Um, a lot of people, some people think he's scary looking or evil or creepy with the smile, or some people just think he's cute. Let me know what you think. I think he's on the more cuter side and he seems really happy to go out trick or treating with his pal, uh, his candy pal, which looks exactly like him. And then if you turn him around here, this is what he looks like going sideways. He does a lot of wiggling, a lot of walking around at night. And then he does have some damage here, but I can fix these with the right colors. He had one on his nose, and I just uh, fixed that before. And then here's the other side of him. And he's sort of like that paper mache type pumpkin, but I don't think he is made of that. Here's what the inside looks like. And, uh, and I'm not sure exactly what material he's made of. You wouldn't want to drop him, though. And then back here he has this rusty-looking uh, bar handle on the back. So I just wanted to throw that guy in real quick. Pumpkin guy from ESC Trading Company. Maybe early 2000s, but it'd be great if you guys knew, knew more about him. And, uh, and just getting ready for Halloween, and I'm, I'm watching tons of YouTube, watching what people are putting up, what their houses look like. It's really cool to see their collection. So this is one of mine, and then just go back out and check the, the ones I've done the last two years for Halloween. Um, and then there's also a lot of vintage Christmas ones on there also, but I know we don't want to think about Christmas yet. So once again, thanks for coming to your favorite YouTube channel. Time travel is possible, and I'll see you guys in the future, time travelers.